We're on the telephone, uh, the Berkeley County uh, Clerk, Tony Petrucci. I was by your office the other day after the uh, forum that we did on the 22nd. Tony, you got a nice office there. Well, thank you. They, the, the commission uh, done a great job uh, getting everybody down there on the first floor. Yeah, let me compliment you on how neat your desk is, by the way. I was rifling through it looking for uh, money, and I couldn't find any, but uh, still. Well, it's, it's there, but it's, it's, it's hidden. <laughs> <laughs> we did find room. the key, though. That was <laughs> <laughs> that was to the yeah. executive washroom, right? Uh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Tony, I'm hearing uh, just anecdotally from uh, some folks who have been in line early voting that the lines are pretty impressive and the enthusiasm is there. Yeah, yeah. Um, yesterday, uh, out of the three precincts that we not precincts, I'm sorry, three voting places that we have, of course, that we added back in May. Uh, total we did uh, 25 over 2500 votes um the betty and rear we had 942 uh downtown at the dunn building we had 838 and the uh pikeside uh substation there uh 783 which i was impressed with because uh in the past it was a little light but of course it was a a primary but it, it it was um was it went well uh big lines uh, um but we got through it and um uh, without any major glitches um uh, when i was on the radio last time we had talked about this we had we were able to uh, purchase 15 more um uh, election uh, uh machines and we actually pulled out uh six of those and used them because we had 10 in each place so we put three more up at the Dunn Building and three at Beddington, and it, it seemed to uh, help out uh, Very their cool that day. So, um, as far as I know, according to my staff, he's done a great job along with the poll workers. Uh, the sheriff department's been very helpful. Uh, Mike Lang, who's in charge of the bailiffs, uh, we've got bailiffs uh, at each location uh, at Beddington and at. Um, Pike side is a 24-hour deal where they rotate. There's a bailiff there all night long, all day and all night to protect the machines. IT department, you couldn't ask for a better situation. They've been there to help us if there's any uh, technological problems. Um, County Administrator, Mr. Wine, has been, been very helpful, anything I've needed. And, of course, the, uh, the people that had to wait a couple hours uh, were very patient. Um, I made it a rule with all the places, anybody that's in a wheelchair or canes, uh, we just pull them right up front and let them vote first. Excellent. So um, it, it went well for the first day. Uh, we got nine more days, so um, not as big as it was yesterday. But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to have a good week. Very good. Look. Hey, Tony, this is John. How does it actually work at the end of the day? Does mm-hmm. uh, or is there a subtotal taken? Essentially, do, do the days yeah, totals we, we get have, downloaded, and then essentially the the machine is empty for the next day? Yeah, we're able. We're, yeah, we're able to fi- uh, do that with uh, early voting. As far as how, that that that's how we come up with the uh, the amount. Mm-hmm. Two thousand five hundred and sixty three votes. Early votes. Yeah. Yesterday, yeah. Tony. Any confusion between the with the Inwood and the Pikeside situation like there was last time? Yeah, no, not that I've heard of. We we worked hard to get that out there in the public that it was you know it's a branch of south berkeley but it's it wasn't in south berkeley so we did correct that it's it's in pikes out of course but it's exactly south berkeley volunteer fire company's uh facility very good all right tony yeah. thank you very much we appreciate the call this morning i appreciate you having me and uh, you all have a good day thank you yep. sir